Hey guys, what's up? I'm here again with some more tutorials, now on a new computer with Windows 8. So I'm going to show you how to put these power options here on your start menu. So what we need to do is go back into our desktop mode, right click, new shortcut, and then we type in, there are four different things that we'd like to create. Shut down, restart, log off, and hibernate. So we're going to start with shut down. To do that we type in shut down space dash s space dash t zero. Now we type in shut down for the name. You can name it whatever you want. And by the way, on the uh, last page, where we type in dash t after this, you can type in the amount of seconds that you want it to wait until it shuts down. Now we can type in shut down for the name again. And we can right click, go to properties, change icon, click OK, and I'm going to choose a power icon. Now we right click on the shortcut, click pin to start, and now we have a shutdown icon pinned to our start menu. Now we're going to go new, shortcut, and next we want to restart. So we type in shutdown again, space dash r, space dash t zero. Again, you can change the zero to whatever you like. My personal preference is zero, so it does it immediately. We're going to name this restart. I'm going to right click, go to properties, change icon, click OK. And I'm going to change an icon that I like. You can change it to whatever you would like. I'm going to change it to this icon. Right click, pin to start. And now we have our restart icon. Next, we're going to do log off. So we're going to do right click, new, shortcut, type in shut down dash L. You can also type in log off. Go to next, I'm going to name it log off. Right click, properties, change icon. I'm going to go up here, select this text, and type in image res.dll. So image res.dll. I'm going to scroll over, and I'm going to find this key icon. I prefer this. But you can change it to whatever you like. Now I'm going to right click, click pin to start, and now we have our log off. Now we're going to do our hibernate. Right click, new shortcut, shut down, space, dash, h, and we do not do any t's or times or anything here. This is does not require any of that. So we're going to name this hibernate. I'm going to right click, go to properties, change icon, click OK. And I'm going to select an icon. For lack of a better option, I'm going to do this computer. I'm going to right click, pin to start. Now we have these four icons here, but to rename it with power options, all we're going to do is either pinch out hold control, zoom out with your mouse, or hit this little minus icon. We're going to right click on our group, click name group, and I'm going to name this power buttons. Now if we zoom back in, or click anywhere, we have a group named power buttons. Thank you for watching, please share this video with your friends, etc. and like it. Um, I'd like to hear from you how you like this, um, and any, any, any other tutorials you'd like to have. So thank you for watching.